So in the comments on my last video, you guys proved to me that it is indeed possible to be OP on low res and low FPS. And by the way, thank you guys for the mad support on that video. So today I challenged myself to play on the lowest res possible while capped at 60 FPS. I did want to go lower because I saw someone in the last video say they got a 4K 20 bomb on 25 FPS, but I didn't bother going that low because 60 FPS is like the standard for most monitors, whether it's a gaming monitor or not. So, so the challenge is try to get 5 kills or more on potato settings. The first thing I did was try to create a customers for 640 by 480 but I got this error saying it's just way too low and the lowest I can play on is 768 by 480 which I did promise zero I would try out. But when the game loaded, in the video section it said I was playing on 1280 by 720 when I was clearly playing on 768 by 480 So I guess this is some kind of bug. I don't know. Then I went into fine range to warm up. I couldn't see anything. Everything just looks way too pixelated and my movement was very choppy because of the 60 FPS cap. But I was still determined to prove to myself and motivate low end PC players that you can still be good. So here's a clip of me getting a 6 bomb. I know it's not a lot, but I'm still very proud I was able to achieve this. Are we all heading for the door? Alright. It's gonna be a big fucking royal rumble. I got a bolt. That's a shit. Reloading. I fire now. Reloading. That was the last buster in that squad. Nice choice. Round one. That is an Armani's box. This way. New kill leader. Watch for them. Death box here. Stay behind this protector. Recharging shields. Okay. Go up in high ground. Oh, this guy's so pleasure. Oh, I missed all those shots. Oh, she's one here. She's cracked here. Oh, she's the one pushing that shit. I swear if I die to that guy, oh my god. Look you guys. I'm going crazy here. In the open. Walking up close on this. Run part one, pushing this. Mirage one. Can't see that guy, can't see that guy. Enemy shield. Get behind your plane. Oh no, we keep swinging this way, we keep pushing this way, we keep pushing this way. We keep swinging around this way. You have to keep moving this way, they're low. Oh fuck, I shoot in the freaking. Yeah, behind this rock. Keep moving, keep swinging this way, keep swinging. No, we'll play here and hold them out. Okay, we loot up and get to um oh yeah, knock one? We'll push this shit. Oh one so one. Push up on this, push up on this. Get aggressive. 
I'm not my glory. Oh, good shit, guys. Good shit. I knock one. Keep playing here. We'll push this way. Oh my god. We need to keep swinging this way. Oh. This guy need one. Keep swinging, keep swinging. There's one guy left here. Go in, guys. Trust. Good shit, good shit. Oh no. Oh, good shit. You know, new. He tried. <laughs> oh, the resin. No one push this. Oh my god, that bitch beaming. Oh my god. We're just, we're just better. <laughs> yeah. Six kills. Insane. So, in conclusion, too, is low end PC settings good enough for Apex Legends? The answer is if you're playing Apex competitively, then no. But if it's casually, then yes. Because in pubs, you have a lot of players that are not confident in their ability to play. And at the same time, you have 300 fps movement demons that will break your ankles so some games can be really good or really bad honestly in that clip i think i just got lucky to be able to secure over five kills but a win is a win a win is a win a win is a win i don't care what y'all say a win is a win i think personally if i was playing with a premier team in rank and we had good chemistry then i think i could maybe get to diamond but it would be a big struggle. But solo queuing, I would be hard stuck goal for. I'd be shooting at everything else but enemies because I can't tell what pixels are enemies or props. My cheeks would be clapped up red every game.